Hi guys, how's it going? So today I have a makeup tutorial, really just on my eyes though. So this is the makeup look that I will be doing today. It's basically like purple eyeshadow with graphic eyeliner. Here it is. I hope that you guys enjoy my tutorial and let's get right into it. Starting out, I'm using my NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk and I'm just applying this all over my eye as a base. And then I'm just gonna use my finger to blend that out all the way up to my brow bone. Next, I'm taking my Jeffree Star Jawbreaker palette, and I'm so sorry it's out of focus, but I'm mixing together two purple shades, Bite Me and Gumdrop. I'm using a kind of smallish brush to apply this, starting on my lower lash line, then I'll be applying it all over my upper lid as well. You can pretty much use any brush for this, maybe a bigger one would be better, but I just felt like using this one. So just keep applying the color all over your lid. I don't really have any technique. I'm pretty messy. I just kind of keep rubbing it around until I'm happy. Now I'm taking my Jeffree Star Bloodless palette and I'm using the shade Blood Queen. And I'm applying it with a fluffy brush, just kind of dabbing it on top and sort of blending it out. It basically makes the purple we already had more intense and pigmented, but I definitely find it helps to have the other purples underneath. Using the Bloodless palette again, I'm taking this white shade called Your Majesty, and I'm just going to be applying this to my brow bone to highlight it, and it also kind of helps smooth out the purple. For my eyeliner, I'm using a liquid felt tip. I like to start in my inner corner and make a cat eye point thing, then I move on to my wing. I start by making the bottom line, and then I basically just go from the tip and drag it down to about halfway on my eyelid, and then you can go ahead and fill it in. I also messed up, but it's okay because I'll just cover it later with eyeshadow. Whenever I make a little mistake like that with the little tick that popped out, I basically just make my eyeliner thicker to correct it, but it doesn't really bother me because I love thick eyeliner anyways. And then you can just go ahead and fill in the rest between your inner corner and the middle of your eye. Now I'm doing my other eye, so I'm just repeating the same steps again. I figured I should demonstrate on both eyes now because eyeliner is a little more technical. So again, I start with my inner corner, then I move on to my wing, starting with the bottom line, then I make a line down towards halfway on my eyelid. As I'm filling it in, I also like to kind of keep going back to the tip of my wing and keep dragging the eyeliner down to perfect it, but of course I managed to mess up again, so I'll fix that later too. Okay, so now is the fun part. We are starting on the graphic eyeliner. We are basically just drawing along our crease in like an art shape. So I like to start in the middle and just make small strokes following the crease. And I also kind of use the shape of my eyeshadow as a guide. Then after you've made your small strokes, you can kind of go over it again to define the line. And you just wanna basically connect it to your eyeliner wing and kind of go in towards your inner corner. Now we're going to repeat the same thing on the other eye. I start in the middle and do small strokes following the natural curve of my eye. For the next step of our graphic liner, we are basically making a line that's going to cross up and above the crease eyeliner we did, and it kind of makes an X. Then from that line, you will make another line going back down, basically making a triangle by connecting it to the arch again. Now we are doing the same on the other eye, and I kind of keep messing it up and having to thicken it to fix it, but it still mostly ends up looking okay. Sometimes switching the angle or the direction of your eyeliner pen helps a lot. Now we are going to make a little triangle wing on the bottom corner of our lower lash line. I just draw a little line going out and then I make a line coming back towards my lash line to create a triangle. Now I'm just drawing a line underneath of my winged eyeliner and I do this on both eyes. 
And then now I'm making another triangle and this one is in the center of my eye, kind of directly under my pupil, and it's just going straight down as a triangle instead of on an angle. And then here I'm just drawing a line going underneath of my inner corner eyeliner and kind of connecting from the point and then going towards that other triangle that I made, so kind of the center of my eye. This next step is optional, but I'm going to be dipping my finger into a sparkly eyeshadow and just dabbing that onto the center of my eye. Next, I'm taking my mascara and I'm applying a generous coat to my top and bottom lashes. I like to make it pretty thick and on the bottom kind of smudge the mascara so that it looks kind of messy. And this is the look completed. I think it's really pretty and I'm really enjoying testing out graphic eyeliner. I've never really attempted it before, but now I'm like obsessed with doing it and I can't wait to try it out with different eyeshadow colors. Also, false eyelashes are optional, but I really love how much more dramatic it looks with them. So I'm just putting some on now so you can see what it looks like both ways. I hope you guys enjoyed my makeup tutorial on this purple eyeshadow with graphic liner. If you recreate this look, please tag me on Instagram at Lady Fell Shadow. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!